Okay. The whole Canari situation is starting to boil over. The Canari have gone and they set a trap figuring that a dwarf would steal their gunpowder, so they, they swapped it out with poison. And the whole and tensions between the Canari and the, the people of Kirkwall have gotten, well, more on edge. Now it seems the Canari were trying to make some sort of diplomatic overtures to the Viscount here, but, well, the ones that came here and met with the Viscount have gone missing, so something, something's going on. Good day to you, and we need to find out what it is. You have information about the missing Canari? I am to help you, yes. Viscount Dumas would appreciate discretion in this matter. I would prefer that you were not involved at all. But that is neither here nor there. We need discretion. That's why we're doing this outside, uh, in a hallway, crowded with people. The Arashok is growing violent. He might want an excuse to end this peace. I suspect that if the Arashok wanted to take over, he simply would. For all we fear that heretical cune of his, its demands have done more to keep him in check than any of our efforts. Besides, would Kunari stoop to trickery? There is no precedent, but there is unfortunate evidence of influence on our side. Has anyone reported this to the Kunari? Maker, no. I'd be signing the messenger's death warrant. He'll find out soon enough, of course. And when he does, the Viscount is rightly concerned that the illusion of peace will dissolve. It sounds like you don't want them found. I must think of what is best for the Viscount's office. Bringing attention to such an incident benefits no one. You would do nothing? The Kunari are neutral hostiles at best. There is no relationship to salvage by overextending ourselves on their behalf. I'm having a hard time picturing the abduction of a Kunari entourage. Unfortunately, they were not at their best. Their swords were tied into their sheaths, as I advised. It seemed a respectful compromise. Even I know you cannot separate a Kunari from his weapon. I don't need your opinion. Get to what you know. The delegate and his entourage could not be made to disappear without the knowledge of the city guard. Not coincidentally, a number of recent recruits have failed to report. You should start with one of them. Although where you find a swordsman so eager to sell his honor and duty, I'm sure I don't know. A hanged man. Hanged man. Obvious one, that. Right. Then you know what to look for. I can't imagine this has occurred without notice. There is always a weak link. Please keep this quiet. The Viscount is under enough scrutiny as it is. Keep it quiet. Everyone here, you didn't hear any of that, right? Everybody here, keep it quiet. Okay, we gotta go to the hanged man to try and... Well, figure out who may have abducted these Kunari delegates. Anyone knows Sir Karen? Has he... Done anything wrong. Hey, Nora, you and me in my room upstairs. Mm, what do you say? Not if you were the last man in the free marches. You okay? I love this place. Don't you love this place? Those two now are still waiting for a ship. Can you believe it? Four years. Well, Captain. Can I call you Captain? You can call me Captain. I won't be doing that. Neither will I. Because you're a guard, Captain. No real authority. Not like on a ship. Well, you would know about having a large number of men under you. You've been waiting to use that one. Did you practice? Shut up. <laughs>
That was weird. Ah, it's just Farrick over there. I'm not going to get involved in these little side quest things. Yeah, I guess we got to wander into the rooms. That's irritating. There is stuff to steal. I'm going to have to start dropping this crap at a vendor. There's no one back here. Ah, there's nothing to that book. What a dump. <laughs> what is it? I get that it's probably like a... You know what? I can't justify it. There are much nicer places in town. I guess that's what you expect to find in low town, but still. <laughs> This guy's a Templar, not a guard. Welcome to the Hanged Man. What's the word on the street? You hear about the Isle of Redcliffe. Some say Andraste herself reached down and cured him so he could unite the land. No, no, that was me in the last game. Any other news? Harlan's thinking of changing the name of the Blooming Rose to Harlan's Harlots. Uh, that works. Any other news? Some folk are smuggling mages out of Kirkwall. I hear the freed mages congregate in the mountains to plot Kirkwall's downfall. That uh, makes sense. Any other news? There's been a bunch of elves camped out on Sundermount for ages. People say they're starting a settlement. Can they do that? The land doesn't belong to them. They're nomads, or maybe uh, gypsies or something. They tend not to stick in one place. If they're doing it, they're probably doing it for a reason. Any other news? Someone stole the Kunari formula for explosive powder. Soon, we'll have the same weapons they do. Yeah, good luck with that one. Any other news? Watch out for pirates and raiders if you plan to travel by sea. The coast around the free marches is swarming. Yeah, I'm not going to be doing that anyway. Any other news? The craziest thing. Apparently, the pigeon population has taken a nosedive in Ferelden. Weird, huh? What kind of sick individual preys on those innocent things? Pigeons are sky rats, and I don't know what that has to do with anything. Any other news? Watch out for pirates and raiders if you plan to travel by sea. The coast around the free marches is swarming. It's not news if I've heard it before. Yes. I should go. Anytime. Hey, Nora. You and me in my room upstairs. What do you say? Hey. I figured it out. You gotta be here at night. Well, you're throwing coins around like there's no tomorrow. That's right, woman. Tonight, I'm paid and blessed, and all I had to do was turn my head. To all my friends. Hey, step back. I know important people. We're going to show this city what to do with heathen oxmen. I call on Aveline here, but uh... Let's see how you do when your target doesn't have their weapon bound. I never touched them, but I can take the likes of you. You want some of this? 
Take it from me and my new friends. You're on your own, pal. That's loyalty for you. Come on. <laughs> Letting this get out of hand real easy. Real quick. <laughs> Eric joined in, even though he wasn't in our party. <laughs> Feeling a little friendlier. What? What do you want? I just did what he said. It was more coin than I've ever seen. Come on. Someone's so generous. They deserve recognition. Templar. It was a Templar. I didn't get the name. We met near the Chantry. He, he said taking these Kunari was serving the Maker. I swear, he even had the seal of the Grand Cleric. True is true. You have got to be kidding me. A Templar. Serving the Grand Cleric, no less. Great. Uh, uh, well, I killed a bunch of people. All but the, uh, the, uh, the guy I was trying to interrogate. <laughs> Ooh, very nice. So a Templar did this. So you're taking the Captain of the Guard to accuse the Grand Cleric of funding Zealots? Uh -huh. Don't forget the kidnapped Canari. That too. Some days, Hawk. The Grand Cleric, please. Tell her... Tell her... Three canari leave an estate and let her finish. Sarah Hawk. Sister Patrice. Mother Patrice. Time has changed us both. Grand Cleric Elfina cannot grant an audience to just anyone. What do you want? Funny how you and issues with the canari seem to go together. And you always assume their side. I was naive when last we met. I did not want you dead, but I felt a death was necessary. That may be too fine a point for you to understand. But you must admit, you came out the better for it. A Kunari delegate has disappeared. She may have ordered it. That is quite an accusation. Ridiculous, of course. She leads a great many people, but not as a commander. A Templar used her seal to convince others the act was righteous. A pause that says you knew, but does her grace. The Grand Cleric trusts her stewards to enact the wishes of the Maker. It sounds like you've been bad. This will shock her grace, no doubt. Stubborn. All right, Sarah Hawk. If you won't abandon this, let me offer you something. The Templar you seek is a radical who has grown unreliable. Confronting him may do us all a favor. And his relation to you is? He is my former bodyguard, Ser Von El. Assume what you wish, but I offer him to you as reconciliation. Meet me at this location. I invite you, Sarah Hawk. Come see the unrest these Kunari have inspired. Need I say I'm skeptical? It's her game for the moment. Sing of the chance of the Well, I doubt we should be trusting Patrice.
she was the one that set us up three years ago to take the take the fall and lead us basically put us in a situation where we'd encounter a bunch of Kunari, they would kill us and then we would be well so looking for a room full of armed zealots Patrice is here somewhere looking forward to it Patrice tried to get us killed. Nothing personal. She just needed somebody to die to turn public opinion against the Kunari even further. No reason to think that she's changed as a person since then. It's probably a trap. Like any beast, remove the fangs and it is lost. They are weak before the faithful of the Maker. The only certainty in their precious cune is death before the righteous. Sevonel! Take a knee, faithful. The Chantry blesses us. You claim a blessing when you have used the authority of the Grand Cleric so openly? You have brought wrath down upon you. You remember Sarah Hawk? The Kunari have friends, Templar. How will you answer their allegations? You want to fight? Face someone whose weapons are not bound. Righteous! Destroy them! Oh, she runs away. That's a lot of people, but they all seem to be low level. Except for that guy. And, uh, Varnell over there. It shouldn't be too hard, I hope. Probably best to focus on someone else for a bit. This is turned against me. Jeez, this was uh, took a long time. All right, time to bring this mess to the Viscount's attention. Madness, madness. That's a word for it. Chantry involvement, even if they are fringe elements. Oh, it could not be worse. Sure it could. You could suddenly realize you're completely naked or something. <laughs> you killed them? All of them? A mother serving the Grand Cleric allowed this to happen. Are you quite sure? She held a blade with them? Told them to fight you? No, I cannot say that. No, of course not. Blasted mother. You have no idea the storm these allegations would cause. It would destroy what support I do have. I have had trouble with her before. She is... slippery. I understand. I will make my inquiries, gently, and you should be careful in your associations. For now, we have other problems. We have the delegate, but 
I can't return the bodies to the Canari in this state. Sarah Hawk. You know the Arishok. What should I do? Hiding this would only make it worse. It would, wouldn't it? I'm losing my sense of how to balance this nightmare. I appreciate your help in this matter. As bad as this is, it could have been much worse without you. Kirkwall owes you. I owe you. All right. The Aeroshock may not have known exactly what happened to them, but had we burned the bodies, they would have suspected something, and they probably would have suspected much worse than what actually was happening. Can't loot that body for some reason. Damn. All right, let's get out here. Ain't gonna be happy. Go without me. I need a stiff one and a drink. Oh, great. You'd never come in here. Hmm. Does anyone find that suspicious? So, human, my delegate was taken from the Viscount's doorstep, and he still claims control of this city. I thought it impossible, but I respect him even less. How do you explain the condition of their bodies? A fanatic used them to incite others of his kind. I accept that. Well, that was easy. I have seen every vice and weakness of your kind, and how few of you take responsibility. Your Viscount remains a fool, but you are not. Panahedan, Hawk. I will keep one good thought about your kind. <laughs> well, anyway, that went over better than I expected, but <laughs> still not that good. May have some respect for Hawk here, but uh, not really for the people of the city itself.